Hey folks, how's it going? My name is Jory and I am so excited to show y'all my newest DIY obsession, makeup remover pads. If you use these babies, you know they can get kind of pricey in the stores. Plus, there's a lot of harmful chemicals in them that really just aren't very good for your skin. They dry you out and it's not a good look. So, I'm going to show you how to make a DIY version that's very easy, super inexpensive, and I guarantee you'll never go back to the store-bought version. So let's get started. I look like I'm doing some sort of science project in my room right now and I'm kind of loving it. So to start things off, all you'll need is some sort of container to put your cotton pads in, just as long as it has a top so you can seal them off once you're done. Um, to get things started, you're gonna go in with a fourth a cup of water. Just pour them right on top of your cotton pads. I promise it'll, they'll all get soaked eventually, so you don't have to worry about that. So that was a fourth a cup of water. And then you'll go in with one tablespoon of liquid coconut oil right on top like so. And then you'll go in with one tablespoon of soap. Just go with maybe your favorite organic and natural soap because it is gonna go on your face. It's not gonna stay there, of course, but it will go on your face for a little while. So just go with something all natural. You don't wanna use something like dish soap. Okay, so you're just gonna go ahead and pour that in. And like I said, this will all get mixed together. So you don't have to worry about that. If this is killing those people out there who like everything done in the beginning. Okay. And then lastly, you don't have to do this, but I love to add in essential oils just because it smells so nice and you can kind of personalize it to what you love. So I'm going to go in with eucalyptus and tea tree oil just because I love those two combined, especially if I'm putting them on my face. So I'm just going to go for one or two drops of each to give these cotton pads a nice smell when I use them. If I could ever get the bottle open, y'all. You'd think I'm a child. Okay, got it. This one's the eucalyptus, so just a couple... Of drops here okay and then this is my tea tree oil which I use on my face all the time anyway so a couple of drops of the tea tree oil all right y'all so once you add in your favorite essential oils go ahead and seal it off and give this a really good shake kind of like you're making a cocktail <laughs> so just give it a really good shake to get all of those pads soaked in it's okay if they don't say stacked on top of each other that's totally fine really the goal here is just to make sure they're all kind of soaked in if you feel like you want to add a little bit more water, then that's totally fine. Okay. Yeah, so I'm feeling really good about that. You can see they kind of spread out and they are all are definitely very, very wet. So, and there you have it. Those are your DIY makeup remover pads. Y'all, I love this project so much. One, because it's way, way less expensive than the store-bought version. And two, it's much better for your skin. Um, I will say though, these are not meant to be your face wash. They're only meant to get your makeup off before you do go in and wash your face with your usual cleanser. As always, thank y'all so much for watching this video. Let us know how these work for you in the comments and I will be back soon with more DIY beauty projects. Y'all didn't think I was gonna let you go without showing you these things in action, did you? Of course not. Here we go. Just made them, let's see if they actually do the job. Well, you can definitely see my natural skin coming through. Y'all, that's amazing. All right, going in with the eyebrow. Goodbye, perfectly placed eyebrow. <laughs> yep, definitely taking off all of my makeup really nicely, y'all. And the tea tree oil and the eucalyptus are very, very nice. Okay. I'm very, very happy with this. Okay, makeup is pretty much removed, y'all. Look at that. That worked very, very well. Again, thank y'all so much for watching. Let us know if this project works for you and we will see you very soon.